you guys. It's 9.30 in the morning, December 1st, and finally about to fly back to Vietnam. It's been three years, so long. <laughs> and uh, uh, we, we went through the TSA check-in, so now we're just waiting for our flight. It's like 11.30, so we got like some time. Two hours. Baby Darren, he's chilling, he's behaving. He's a good boy. I'm gonna record on my iPhone for now because my camera's in the bag and I don't want to take it out. So, yeah, if it's a little shaky, sorry guys. 17 hour flight, I don't know if I can handle it. <laughs> it's been three years since I flew international, so uh, we'll see. Yeah. But this time, no spicy food, no dairy. So, yeah, should be good. We had like tons of luggage, two check luggage each. Uh, Darren had one carry-on luggage, but that's checked. And we got two backpacks and two uh, carry-ons that we will carry. I think we're gonna stop by the 7-Eleven uh, inside the airport. There's a, there's a Chick-fil-A right here. And there's a 7-Eleven right here. Yeah. Got some Chick-fil-A. What? Yeah. The hash browns are gone. I don't eat Chick-fil-A breakfast much, but when I do, it's really good. Really yummy. Because I'm boring and I eat cereal every day. <laughs> um, but it's kind of like our brunch right now because... Uh, we're just waiting for the for the gate. <laughs> Look at Darren. Darren, he's hangry. He wants some of the Chick Fil A. He he knows. Let me see. I uh, I can't really. I, I can't flip the camera over. But our gates, like, over there. What? Oh, yeah. It's okay. We might buy some more hash browns if we're still hungry. So yeah. Yep. Um, looks like our plane might be delayed, so hopefully not too long, but uh, we're not too worried since once we hit Korea, we'll just have an overnight layaway, so and we plan to get a room to sleep over, so yep, shouldn't be an issue. Not looking forward to the 17-hour flight. <laughs> I, hope, I hope Darren... Um, just sleeps through most of it that would be better for all of us but who knows it's pretty hyper during the daytime so yeah. all right i'm gonna eat the rest of this catch you guys in a bit all right on the plane and kids like two two rows in front of me so we're not together but pretty close um, we'll probably have to take friends holding Darren uh, they're serving lunch and uh, it's like almost 1 o'clock 1 p.m. so we just flew for like maybe 30 40 minutes uh, I chose to get cotton pound chicken so, oh it's hot I just wanted water, so nothing, nothing too much. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and open this. Uh, I'm gonna watch uh, Venom. I never saw it. Uh, the second one, so with Carnage. You know, plenty of time to watch that later. Maybe I'll watch it when I'm eating. Good. And uh, for 
airport food. I know Korean Air, I had it before and it was pretty good. So yeah, all right, cool. Uh, I don't think I'll eat much of this, but yeah, I'll eat a little bit. I had the Chick-fil-A earlier, so I'm not too hungry. All right, guys, uh, I'm gonna go eat now. So see you guys in a bit. Just landed in Korea. It's uh, 6.30 here p.m. Basically 3 a.m. at night though, our time. What are we waiting for? Stroller and oh, car seat. Oh, stroller? Okay. Waiting for the stroller and car seat. It looks dark outside and it's only like 6 something. Try to find a room and check in and get some sleep. Mm. What? Ooh, toy store. Ah, oh, pulling two luggage is not fun. It's like what, 2.30 in the morning right now? We failed to get a transit room um, or a hotel. It was, it was booked. We didn't think about reserving ahead of time. So when we uh, fly back home, we're definitely gonna reserve. Um, pretty much December was booked. Uh, February is open though, so when we come, we can definitely reserve. There was like a free transfer lounge where you can take naps and sit around and stuff. But like there was these loud, like freaking loud teenagers and random people like talking. Yeah, these teenagers were just like drinking the whole time, playing like some shot game behind me. <laughs> and uh, yeah, just could sleep like bits and pieces. Um, the, the chair that I slept in was kind of like curvy, so I wasn't used to it too. I tend to sleep on like flat objects. <laughs> so, but uh, now I'm back up and I had a chance to like take out my contacts and brush my teeth. Now we're just looking for a place. Oh, can we go this way? I feel like we have to walk around, right? Okay, whatever. We're just looking for a place to get some food and stuff and sit and relax some more. Yeah, this looks pretty cool. Yeah. Also, we should go find uh, the currency place in the airport. Maybe convert some money into one. Yeah, because most places here, I think, just accept uh, their currency, one, unless you use a credit card and you pay like a foreign transaction fee, which sucks. So, yep, probably a lot of walking right now. We don't fly until like 11.30ish 11. 11 in, um, in the afternoon, so, or noon, yeah. So we have we have like over ten hours or something still. Just chill, but in our local time, it's like mm, pretty much like eleven a.m. back home. So our bodies are definitely used to that time. Uh, we're two forty-eight right now. sleeping on and off too. It's been a challenge for him. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna go find a place and see if we can exchange money and also get some food. So we end up finding some food. There's only Starbucks that's open at this time in the, in the morning, uh, late, er, early morning. 
or late night, whatever you want to say. Uh, prices seem okay uh, compared to like if I was to buy food in an American airport. We only spent like 12 bucks, um, give or take, uh, for some mango juice, English muffin with egg. Uh, I got like a hot dog slash sausage. Um, and and a banana yep so not too bad um, and they also accepted US dollars which um, which is perfect because they gave us change in Korean won so currency place is closed right now so it would have been a little tricky and we might have to use a card again and yeah so glad we had some glad they accepted cash Hey guys, so it's been a long time, long night, long morning. I managed to get like a little sleep, um, like an hour, an hour, 20 minutes uh, through that uh, spot of, of where we were sitting earlier near the Starbucks. Um, luckily, my wife was able to watch Darren, but he's been pretty sleepy and that's making him really fussy. So. Uh, we we just had another meal um it was um like chinese food pretty good um considering you know it's at the airport but the food at this airport's pretty good and pretty affordable so yeah uh it's like 8 30 ish right now in the morning and the flight's at 11 15 so we're right on time so far fingers crossed I'm um, just waiting at the gate, um, back here, 2.35, yeah, right here, right here. So, five more hours and then we'll hit Vietnam, finally in Da Nang. So, can't wait to see all the family, it's going to be very exciting. Uh, me and Yang, or me and my wife, is really tired and sleepy and I know Dan is still tired. His schedule is screwed up and uh yeah once i get some time to settle and rest i'll go over like the trip like the flight experience and everything and give my thoughts in two cents but right now um i think we're just gonna chill for the next few hours until the until we start to board all right i'll see you guys then Anyways, as you can see, uh, Darren's knocked out right now, so that's good. Getting him to sleep is hard because it um, has to be near a quiet place and we kind of have to, um, you know, soothe him to, to relax and just fall asleep. Sadly, even if you're sleepy, you know, you just, uh, babies don't just fall asleep by themselves sometimes and you gotta, you gotta help them fall asleep. Okay, just wanted to show you guys Darren real quick. Hello. Yeah, we're on the final plane to go to Da Nang, so just a little longer and we'll be there soon. Looks like they gave us everything the same. Uh, a blanket, earphones or headphones. 
slow, but no slippers. But our trip's only like five hours. This is a really big plane though. So yeah. Uh, we got to board first, so we're just waiting for everyone to get on now. Landed baby in the airport and we're gonna have to find our baggage. <sighs> and it's so humid and and uh, it's raining. It's raining all week. Darren just woke up. Alright, see you guys in a bit. Literally just waiting, waiting for the luggages. It's taking a while, but I put air tags on all four, checked the bags, and I know they're nearby, so at least they're not lost. Some family here. Got to see my father in law, and he's pushing the stuff. Nieces and nephews.